In this video, we are going to demonstrate how to use the e for HPC software to create a workflow using two HPC sites. As example, we are using the Tropical Cyclone workflow from Pillar 2. This workflow is composed by a first ex execution that executes the CMC -C CM3 model simulations in the CU supercomputer at CMCC and a second computation that executes a tropical cyclone detection in North 3. The results of the first computation are automatically transferred from CUS to North 3 with a SSH to SSH data pipeline. In Arim4 Cloud, we can see the Tosca topology of the workflow, where we can observe two HPC site descriptions. The source site is connected to the CMC CCM3 <laughs> model computation and the target is connected to the tropical cyclone detection computation. The SSH to SSH pipeline is, connecting, uh, is connected to both sites. There are two more pipelines to download some necessary input for the tropical cyclone part and to upload the final results. The workflow is deployed with Alien4 Cloud. We have selected CMCC 3 machine for the source environment and the BSC Nord 3 machine for the target environment. Once deployed, the workflow can be executed in Alien4 Cloud. In this case, we have to provide the user ID for the source and the target environment and the generated token ID, together with the datasets and path where the different computations will be executed. In the first step, we can see the CMC -C CM3 computation is submitted in the CUS machine. In parallel, a data pipeline is executed to download the input data for the tropical cyclone. Once the execution of the CMCC CM3 computation is finished, the SSH to SSH pipeline is moving the data to North 3 supercomputer to continue with the tropical cyclone detection computation. The last step, step executes a data pipeline to store the results in the V2Share repository. 